show because I'm stupid. What are you doing? Ah. Hey guys, it's Jay and today I'm here with a very exciting announcement as well as my TBR for this announcement. I was asked by Dylan to help with the Emojiathon this year. If you guys don't know what the Emojiathon is, it is a month-long readathon that's being held this June and basically there's a list of challenges and you need to complete four of them. So basically one book a week if you want to be technical. There's going to be a lot of Twitter sprints over on Twitter so make sure you follow the Emojiathon Twitter which I will leave down below and the fun part is that I get to host one of the Twitter sprint days which is going to be June 14th. So if you want to come hang out with me on Twitter then go follow the Emojiathon Twitter and uh, we can be BFFs. So without further ado, let us get started. So as I said, you only have to complete four out of the challenges. Obviously, you can do as many as you want. I personally picked five books because I can usually read five in a month, so we're probably going to be okay. I'm going to leave the list of challenges down below if you guys want to check it out for yourself. Let us get into my TBR. The first emoji that I'm choosing to read is the little present emoji, and it is supposed to be a book that was gifted to you, so I am going to read How to Break a Boy by Lori DeVore. Technically, this was not gifted to me because I want to give away, but like, I mean, that's kind of a gift, right? We're going with it. This book could also fulfill the little baby emoji, which is to read a new release from 2016 or 2017, so this like recently came out, so there you go, there's another challenge. But this could also fulfill my contemporary romance, which is the heart emoji, which is my next book. So as I said, the heart emoji is supposed to be read a romance contemporary book, so I am picking Just One Day by Gail Foreman. So many people have read these books and they say that they're really cute, so I want some cute in my life. The next emoji that I chose is the little heart eye emoji. That is a cover you bought because it's beautiful, basically. So I'm going with Iron Trial by Holly Black and Cassandra Clare. I just like that it's shiny and I like the colors. So, and it's also short, so you know, it's good for a the next emoji that I chose is the like shocked face, you know what I'm talking about? And it's supposed to be a read a thriller or horror book. And basically I could just like reach behind me and pick any book off my shelf because like that's basically all I read. But the one that I chose is The Enemy by Charlie Higgs. And this has been on my shelf for over two years, like before I started booktube, and I still haven't read it, which I don't know why because I've been obsessed with this book because of the black pages. I think it's so pretty. So we're finally gonna read it, hopefully this month. Then the next emoji I had to pick just because I make that face way too often in real life. It is the emoji where he's like, you know what I'm talking about? You know, the little squinty like, yeah. That emoji represents a book that you are annoyed with yourself for not reading yet, and I am going with the third Harry Potter book, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. If you've been on my channel since the beginning, you know I've never read Harry Potter. I'm 21 years old and I've never read Harry Potter. I read the first two books already in May. So now we're on to the third book and it's gonna happen and I'm so excited and I'm gonna film my reaction as I have for the last two Harry Potter books, so stay tuned for that, but I'm so excited and I, I'm like kicking myself for not reading these yet because they're so good. Alright guys, so that was my Emojiathon TBR slash announcement. I'll leave all the relevant links down below for the original host, the guest host so you can come hang out with us on Twitter. June 14th is when I'm hosting, so make sure to come hang out with me. And I will leave the challenges down below as well. I hope you all participate and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye! Yeah.